what is thrashing in operating system from the concept of phase default we are aware that when there is no space in the main memory and cpu requests a portion of the program consider in this case that portion of the program resides in phase 2 of process 1 this has to be executed now so for execution it should be loaded first and during the mapping from virtual to the physical address it will see in the phase table of p1 process that the present bit for this phase 2 is zero which indicates that this phase is not loaded to the main memory and it will trigger a trap called phase fault which will demand this phase 2 to load here first in the main memory as we are not having any free space in this main memory so the memory management unit will try to free up some space which were not being utilized recently and if it sees this phase 1 of process 2 has not been executed recently it will try to free up this space so this space will be swept out from this frame in the main memory and the portion of the program which is available in phase 2 of process 1 requires loading now in this free up space so this space will be swept in in this free space or available space this process is called swapping so in this case of phase fault and swapping process major time is spent here in the millisecond because it has to copy from the secondary memory which takes comparatively higher time that is in millisecond so this swap out and basically this swap in will take higher amount of time and think about a scenario where you are having maximum number of process to be executed so in that case all processes for example just consider you have opened so many apps in your computer think that you are something on microsoft excel sidewise you are doing some graphing design in background you are playing some music and different different bunch of things you are doing so in that case all the processes need to be loaded into the main memory and your cpu utilization will go higher and there will be a time when your cpu utilization will go maximum level and your main memory is completely full so in that case the chance of this phase default will increase because a lot of process will try to execute at the same time and there is no free space so it will keep on triggering the phase fault and this process of swap out and swap pen will be very frequent so in this scenario a lot of time will be spent for this swapping purpose itself which will degrade the system performance very significantly and this is called thrashing where cpu utilization at maximum level phase default is happening very frequently and the process of swapping swap out and swap in is happening for most of the time and a lot of time is spent in this process this state is called thrashing in operating system so this was the small brief about thrashing in operating system please let me know in the comment box if you have still any doubt regarding this thrashing topic thank you so much for watching this video and we'll see you soon